Disclaimer, you probably don't want to follow the way that I gear cleanse because I'm what I consider to be very, very brutal and borderline stupid. But it's been working for me for five years and, you know, so it works for me, but it might not work for you. So don't exactly copy the way that I do things. I'm an game player here. Um, so if you're below that or not quite there yet, probably take this with a grain of salt. The other thing is I wanted to discuss that, hey, with all of the fucking gear that they're introducing into the game, the pinpoint, the, the stuff that you get from Centronos and Live Arena, guys, Polarium, please increase 1500. Just make it unlimited. Why is there, why is there a limit to how much gear we can have? On top of that, why do we still have to lease our gear? Why is it that we pay energy, spend the time to do the dungeons and do whatever it is to get the gear, and then anytime I want to take it off, I have to fucking pay to take off my own clothes. What the fuck is that? When it comes to gear, what I'm starting to do on both of my accounts is, well, let me bring you guys up to speed. This is the way I do gear cleanses right now, all right? So anything from one to five, auto sell. I don't give a shit what it is. I don't care if it's one of those pay to win sets or those really hard sets to get. Most people aren't going to agree with it. I can see where they're coming from. And yes, I do agree with them. For most players, the greater majority of people, yeah, you don't want to sell, especially the artifacts, the, the limited time artifacts as well, uh, or accessories, the jewelry. But I do it anyway, just because I'm, I'm very particular about how I like to keep things organized. So that's one thing that I do. Now, it's been a while since I've actually done a advanced gear cleanse, but uh, one of the things that I also look for is basically anything with flat stats that I don't like. So the flat stats that I don't like are HP, attack, and flat defense and if anything has that multiples multiples of that i'm more than likely more than likely going to sell it now it's been a while since i've done it but this is obviously going to have to get sold this one's going to get sold too i am iffy about this one because it's already fully ascended so and it's a regen set it's got hp on hp with some speed on it there are always going to be exceptions right but you want to be very 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 strict about what you consider to be exceptions I'm going to make an exception for this one, right? We follow the rules, but we can make exceptions here and there, but don't make too many exceptions because if you make too many exceptions, you end up saving too much gear. So this, automatically gonna get sold. We're saving the instinct, it's pay to win. Uh, Supersonic and Merc gear, we gotta keep that because right now it's all scarce, right? So first looking at all of the sets of gear that has the flats that I don't like, um, I'm just gonna start going through them and you can hang out with me and, and see uh, my, my thinking process. But before we go through the substats, the other thing that I start to look for is triples, are triples, right? If the gear, the piece of gear has a triple, then I'm going to keep it. If it has at least one roll on red, then I keep it. And that's, that's kind of what I'm, what I'm doing, right? Right. If the piece of gear has at least one roll on red, then I keep it. If it's got a triple, I keep it. If it doesn't, then I'm going to sell it. And we're going to go through this right now and you'll you'll see me going going about doing that the other thing that i'm paying attention to is the type of set right so if it's a life set or a defense set or something like crit rate accuracy i'm more than likely to sell it gear sets that i don't use because especially with something like accuracy or life there's better versions of it immortal but if this rolls a quadruple then i'm gonna keep it so what i do i roll it to eight See if it rolls a double. If it doesn't, then I just sell it, right? Because we're looking for quadruples and that's it. Same thing here. If, especially if we get a, a quad on speed, that'd be pretty nice, right? And we don't get that, so we sell it. On epics, so what I do for epics, any epic piece of gear, I'm about to go through the entire thing, so I don't honestly do it too much, but anything that's epic that has at least one bad substat, I'm going to sell it unless it's a triple on a good set that matches, right? It's a crit damage weapon with a triple on attack. It's got crit damage on it. We're making an exception this time. Accuracy, we have triple accuracy with some speed and defense. I don't really like the flat HP. And again, you do have better sets out there, but we rolled the triple here, so I'm just gonna keep it. Here, we're gonna sell these because it has at least one flat that I don't like and it's not rolled yet. We're gonna sell this. We got a triple speed on that one. So this was previously uprolled at a different time. We're gonna keep it, it's triple speed. That's, it's gonna be a good offset piece. 
regen you do want resistance on it regeneration we have triple speed on it those are triples we're making exceptions again hp with speed on it triple speed and it's already enhanced again this was a boot that i worked on before but you know it's always good to update your gear every now and then and so we're going to keep this one this one stays with us triple speed same reason it's on a shield set savage now savage gear is a bit of a hard one for me to let go of just because savage gear is so good however nowadays with lethal and now mercenary or merc merc gear and slayer although slayer is pay to win i don't think i'm gonna worry too much about slayer or instinct but merciless gear is probably going to be what i'm gonna end up getting most of within due time right so i think what i can start doing is letting go of savage pieces and only keeping the absolute best of the best the other thing to consider before doing advanced deep cleanses is knowing whether or not your champions are built the way that you need them to be built for whatever area of the game that you're looking to uh complete right so what, what am i saying like i'm not going to do a gear an advanced gear cleanse and really purge my gear unless i know all of my champions are built if there's like a thor that i just got i'm not going to sell anything until my thor is built the way that i want him to be in the set and the gear and the stats that i need him to be right because what if there's a piece of gear that i have here that he could use so i build my champions first and then i go into this i am starting to pump up the amount of savage that i have and I'm already doing hard fire night consistently. So, you know, if I really need to, then I'll, I'll just, you know, farm for more savage. But at this point, I, I just have so much gear. I'm approaching 1500. And every time I drop down, it just goes right back up because of all the gear. And most of the time, I just end up staying in Sand Devil and Phantom Shogun anyway. Right. So I'm just going to start getting rid of these. Except for this, it's a triple. We're going to keep that one. We do have that. There's no triples there. No triples. If it doesn't triple, we're selling. There's a triple right there. So we're selling it. Trying not to keep too much. Destroy percentage with speed. We're getting rid of that. Triple speed. Keep it. I meant uh, keeping that. Keeping that. Triple speed too. Cruel. Triple crit rate on cruel. That's good. Attack with triple speed. Good. We got the defense. Nothing wrong with the little defense. If I really needed to, I would re-roll that to ascend uh, to, ascend to um, attack defense with one flat that we don't like get rid of that get rid of this there's a flat here that we don't like the better version of accuracy is going to be perception maybe they come out with a forge pass with pinpoint in the future who knows but i think pinpoint is a step up above perception i think pinpoint's even better than feral gear i'd have to check no triples here there's a triple on speed there we keep that triple on speed with resistance nothing wrong with that speed boots HP percentage, but I don't like the other rolls. I don't like the ascension, so we're going to get rid of that. Get rid of this too. Same reason. Speed triple guardian set. Kind of on the... It's a decent roll. It's a decent triple roll. Lethal set. Now, lethal gear is also not exactly the easiest to come by because we're waiting for the Dark Fae all the time. I'm not going to let my, my lethal gear go that easily, although this one is just a completely shitty roll attack percent with defense sometimes you just come across gear that's just absolutely shit and you just have to sell it but it also makes whatever champion that i want to build work temporarily so i just might hold on to it because you never know i mean i'm going to revisit it again because this is probably going to be a, a long gear cleanse keep on uh, holding on to that right now when it comes to perception and or when it comes to protection and stone skin i tend to let go of these just because we get a lot of it from doing hydra on a consistent basis so this there's a pretty stable income of protection and stone skin gear so i'm more likely more than likely to get rid of those i'm more than likely to go ahead and get rid of those now the other thing that i'm thinking about is the speed roll like what if this rolls a triple speed that could be more than worth keeping so i'm looking for triple speed if it has a flat on the on the main or the bottom row of gear i'm more than likely to sell it too unless it's something that i might want to re-roll so triple speed on that we're going to keep that triple hp on that we're going to keep that we're going to sell it we're not rolling that up accuracy on stone skin what do you guys think about that one this piece here i'm going to keep it for now it is a triple and sell sell 
We're going to sell, maybe. I like seeing triple speeds, so we're going to roll that up right now and check it out. Crit damage, defense, pretty decent. I like it. Good enough to keep. We could reroll that. I like, uh, uh, generally, generally speaking, I don't like crit damage on anything else except for damage type gear, but um, I have a good feeling about it, especially with the triple roll here. And plus, it's a triple roll, so we'll keep it. Triple res with accuracy, stone skin, that's good. Res is always good on stone skin. HP percent, got some speed on there. Resistance, double HP percentage, but we already ascended it to speed, so we're going to keep that. And I don't like this one, so we're just going to sell it. Don't like that one, we're going to sell it. Sometimes I just look at gear and I'm like, I don't fucking like it, so I just sell it. This one's actually okay. We have three substats that we do like. We've got res. I don't like the ascension, but we can change that out later. Rip on the flat, but we'll keep that. I think this one I walked by, I saw I didn't really care much for this one. No, 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 no. Because that's that's what's happening right now. I'm convincing myself to keep this gear. No, no, we're, we're selling it. We're selling. We're getting rid of it. There's there's no reason to keep this uh, except for, for that one. Getting rid of it. See? You see what I mean? It's so easy to talk yourself into keeping gear. No. We pro we're still looking at this. We're probably going to get better gear in the future. Uh, then the question is, oh, well, what if you don't? But I mean, again, we got we got to keep the best of the best only, right? Let's get rid of kill stroke. Does anybody even use kill stroke? I don't use kill stroke for anything. It's like a better version of crit damage sets, but I don't know. Uh, this is a triple. We'll keep it. Uh, nope, we're getting rid of that. Instinct gear is pay to win. We're going to keep it. Just take a look at it, though. Double speed, double speed, double attack, crit rate. Yeah, we'll keep that. Bolster, another pay to win set. Going to hold on to it for the most part. Defiant gear I don't really like and I don't really use. I'm pretty sure I didn't buy the, the forge pass for this one. Uh, triple speed, we'll keep that. Double HP speed. Um, sometimes when it's hard for me to decide, I think to myself, okay, if I knew that this set was, or if I knew this piece of gear was good, I would just keep it. I wouldn't even ask about it, right? So we're going to get rid of that. Impulse. I am going to hold on to this because I know for the Marius missions, I'm going to need impulse gear. Dude, nine live arena chests and still no zeal boots that's crazy so we're gonna hold on to that for now probably sell it later righteous is an okay set in my opinion nothing wrong with it triple speed keep that now supersonic merciless and everything below we're going to hold on to it just because i need to reassess later on once i've got a huge stockpile of supersonic and merc gear because it's it's limited by what i'm able to get from centranos right so and then pinpoint obviously we're gonna hold on to that so right now we're gonna sell all this Got the stats we don't like. Same thing here. The triple accuracy, we keep it. Resistance with defense, fully ascended. If it's fully ascended, I'm already more than likely just going to hold on to it. HP, triple defense, good. Attack, triple crit rate on a speed. That's pretty good. Sell this. Sell that, maybe. I forgot to roll up the pieces of gear. All right, if it hits speed, nope, sell it. Yeah, there were, I think there was stone skin gear. I forgot to roll up. Keep that. And I think what I'd like, what I'd like to start doing is just ascending everything to see if... Um, that way I have an indicator, basically. If I just put at least one, then I can indicate to myself, okay, I already looked at this piece of gear. It's good to go. But if it doesn't have an ascension on it, it's probably something I didn't look at. So, say like this one, I'm keeping it. Triple speed, relentless, awesome. Now, this one doesn't have a triple and relentless gear is always in high supply at least for me so i'm gonna be more likely uh more than likely to let go of it crit damage but we have hp on defense if it triple rolls onto something i'm gonna keep it so let's see roll it up to eight no triples all right so we're getting rid of that Resi uh, resilience gear we're gonna keep this because it's got a triple on it and speed with double now we're gonna get rid of it we're gonna get rid of uh, keep that Lethal, we're going to keep. Protection, this one can go. That can go, that can go. We get a lot of stone skin. Attack and attack on stone skin. Not the best substats, but we already have it fully ascended, so might as well just keep it. Might make uh, sense for a rare Pokemon or something. Defense, double HP. Now we're going to sell this. Uh, triple speed on defense. We'll keep that. And no triples there. Just get rid of it. I don't use kill stroke and we're holding on to these. What about this? I don't care about, uh, let's see. Re resistance with speed is pretty good. Attack, speed, and there you go. Sell those, get rid of those. 
and we'll work from the bottom up. Check this, triple speed. HP percentage with crit rate and res. I don't really like the combination of substats on this piece. Uh, accuracy with attack, sell it. Triple speed, keep it. Speed boots and speed boots there. Let's roll these up, see where they land. Please give me a triple. Well, no, 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 no. All right, let's see, give me a triple. Oh my God, what the fuck? Why does it, both times on the flat, on the flat, both times, it's fine. And again, a lot of you guys will not agree with the way that I do my gear. I'm not telling you to do it. I'm just showing you guys this is how I do it. This is how I do it. Triple. If it doesn't triple, we sell. Uh, that's bad. That's bad. It's got a flat that I don't like. Don't care. And Immortal and Cruel Gear, obviously. You get such a high supply of it. This is already fully ascended. HP with defense, triple crit damage. Keep it. Now, triple crit damage on an Immortal set isn't exactly the best, but, I mean, it's a triple, so we'll keep it. Accuracy on Reflex. Uh, mercenary, mercenary is now a better version of reflex we have hp on shield with double speed but it's not good enough for me to want to keep gotta be a little bit more brutal than that speed triple defense all right so now with those parameters out of the way i need to start going through everything one by one i still have 829 pieces of gear out of 1500 you see how hard this is now what i'm looking for here is speed on defense if it doesn't hit that, then I'm going to sell it. Um, speed is always in high demand, so that's what we're looking for. Now, we did hit one red, so we keep it. Here, we're looking for a triple on res. And we don't. But uh, Mythical Gear is a little bit different, in my opinion. Because with one red, then we're kind of like already getting one roll on it. So I think it's pretty good. But I'm going to make an exception for it because it is a speed with technically one roll on speed. Kind of. It's uh, like if, if this was a regular like 5 or 6 and then you hit it, then it would turn into like 11 or 12 or something like that. So it's fine. We got double res, double crit damage, making an exception. Just can't do it too many times. No triples here. Uh, no triples there. Yeah, there's a triple there. We keep that. No triples there. Triple is right there. Got a triple there. Triple. Triple. Got the triple on the red. Triple on the red. Triple. 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 And yeah. So you guys get it. Although this one's kind of awkward because we have defense, crit rate substat, uh, crit rate sub ascension. And then we have the substat being a flat triple. It's hard for me to look at this. I think what I wanted to, oh, that was after re-rolling it. Okay. Uh, honestly, it's shit. So we're just gonna sell it. Uh, I'm not gonna try and convince myself. This is okay to keep. Triple there, triple. And we have one on the speed, so we're okay with that. One on the crit rate, crit rate there. Now this is fully ascended, we're just going to keep it. HP, triple defense, looked at that one already. That's good, that's fine. Good, so a bunch of triples or reds, one exception there. Here I'm looking for speed. So if we get speed here, we don't, so we sell it. Here there's nothing that I really care about, but I mean, still if it rolls a quad, because I'm a quad collector, so that's another thing. If you like quads and you just want to keep them just because, you know, triple speed there. Give me speed. Oh, oh no, that was speed. Hold on, let me see. Give me more speed. No speed there, so we sell it. All right. And this is a flat. Even if it rolls a quad, it's not something that I would waste an ore on. Here we're looking for more speed and we get no speed. Crit rate gear is not my favorite, so we're looking for simple off pieces, basically. That's why I'm looking for speed. And nope, none there. Got, uh, it's accuracy, but it's okay. Um, this is gonna be a no for me, dog. This is painful for me to look at. 
honestly. Even though it does have substats that I do like, speed, crit damage, and attack. Like, this is okay, but it's all I hate seeing 111s, so that's just a sell for me. Speed, if this rolls a triple, then we can we can definitely keep this. So triple speed. No triple speed, we sell. Triple crit damage. No, so we sell. Triple attack there. We have, oh, a Penta Res. That's obviously not going to help out with crit damage, but it's still nice to see. Triple speed, triple crit rate, triple crit damage, crit damage, double. Yeah, we're going to sell that. There's no triple there. And um, if this rolls a triple defense, I might be so inclined to keep it. Nope. Okay, never mind. We sell it. Just got to get rid of it. Sell it. Forget about it. Now, this one is crit damage on a crit damage gauntlet. We have double attack speed, but we have a flat red and some res. Hmm. Um. I think it's okay for now. And we got quad right there. Defense. I like asking you guys how you guys would cleanse gear or like what you guys would do with specific pieces. Speed, crit rate, perfect. And we got attack percentage. Uh, I like to see how you guys would manage gear. Sometimes I do community posts and I'm like, hey, what would you do with this piece of gear? Piece of gear. And uh, I like seeing what you guys say. Double, like, double on the accuracy, triple here. Let's see if we can get a quad speed. Give it to me. And no quad speed. We sell it. Triple HP, triple HP, double HP, one on the res, double for speed, that's good enough for me. Triple speed, triple res, triple speed, triple ac. Can we... Okay, so this one's a little bit iffy. If we roll a penta, I'll sell, or I'll re-roll it. Nope, okay. Meaning that if it was going to hit red and there was four reds, I would re-roll this, but no. And it's also flat main HP. So we'll sell it. Accuracy on accuracy with triple HP. That's good. Same. That's good. And we're selling this flat main attack. Keep that. Uh, wait, should we keep that? Crit rate with accuracy and speed HP. It might be a simple good offset, but yeah. Um, let's just roll it up just to see. And we get the accuracy. Yeah, that's, that's good keeping. Good off, off piece. Defense, HP, resistance, got the attack, triple speed, triple HP, triple crit damage on a fury, triple speed, give me speed. Okay, wait, no, that was one speed. Can I get two speeds? No two speeds, okay, we sell. Day set is one that I don't like either. I don't really care for it, but uh, if it rolls a triple speed, which it doesn't, Triple speed there. Hmm. No, we're going to sell it. Just sell it. Keep that. And triple speed there. We keep that. Check this here. Oh, double speed. Triple speed. Quadruple speed. Quadruple speed. Oh, uh, we still got triple speed, though. So we're good. We'll keep it. Curse set. Hard for me to let go of because I really like cursed gear, especially for Hydra, but I'm doing just fine, so I can be a little bit lenient with letting these pieces go. That's a flat. That's also a flat. We sell that. Those are also flats. We sell that. Frost set. I don't know anybody who uses frost set, but there are some niche champions, I guess, who could benefit from it. Uh, crit rate, speed, speed, speed. Quad, speed, speed. Why do I get a lot of speed on sets that I don't need? HP with speed, double speed, and defense. It's good enough. Alright, I don't like seeing 111s! One, one, Alright, we're gonna sell this because I don't like seeing... Well, actually, if it hits... Defense, I might keep it. Nope, all right, we're selling this. 
I don't know anybody who uses Frenzy Gear. Give me defense, triple, and no. Okay, so yeah, we sell it. Let's see, triple, triple, triple? Accuracy? Nope, okay. We don't really need crit damage for regen. Res is good, HP is good, speed is good for regen sets. But if it's already there, we keep it. This one has speed on it. Triple? Nope. Okay. Get rid of that. Speed. Speed. HP. Oh, we talked about this one already. Defense. Give me triple quad HP. Res. But this res is on the low end. We'll see. I'll keep it if it, if it hits res. No, it doesn't. All right. We're getting rid of it. Crit damage. Dear God. All right. I mean, I guess it could help Rotos solo something. <laughs> Just put him in a regen set. All right, triple attack. Nope. All right. Crit damage again. Give me this on Savage. Nope, that's a sell. I shouldn't even have even rolled that one up. That was bad to begin with. Whatever. Defense HP. Triple. Let's roll this up to... See if we get a quad here. Again, crit damage on a set that I don't need. That's fine. HP, give me HP and res, or res. Double, no. All right, we sell that. How does it roll? Give me speed. Nope, okay. Check this one. Res, give me speed. Nope, not, not the rolls that I want. And this one, we're gonna check to see if we get a triple. We do get a triple, triple defense, that's good. But this one has a bunch of 1-1-1s. One, one, this one uh, isn't going to roll on speed and I don't like the other, other subsets for it, so we sell. Shield set, speed, triple accuracy. Uh, this one is gonna be complete shit, so we just sell it. Speed, because it had the substats that don't really matter for this specific um, gear set. Resistance? Oh no, it wasn't a triple though. Alright, we sell it. This is already fully ascended. HP, triple speed, triple defense with speed. I already talked about that one. Triple, triple. Give me a triple. Speed. This one's really nice. Okay, give me triple crit rate then. Or not. We're gonna sell you then. No business being here. Triple, triple. And a good way to manage your gear is just to roll it up as soon as you get it and then see if it's something that you want to keep. Otherwise, you just stack and it just stays there. And then you start approaching your limit and then it goes into the inbox and you're just like, shit. Because gear cleanses take a really long time to do if you want to do like a really in-depth one. Speed. Give me... Oh, no triples there. Speed. Give me speed here. All one one ones. So, triple speed. All right, I see how it is, Polarium. Thank you. Triple speed. Triple accuracy. Res. Nope. Okay. Speed. Double HP, but we have crit damage and crit rate. It's already fully ascended. Just keep it. Uh, crit damage with attack, flat defense. We got one on speed. Um, no. Just don't don't even think about it. Just get rid of it. Sell it. Hurry. Before I I convince myself. Flat defense. Maybe if we roll, yeah, sell it. Don't even go back and look at it. Give me a triple something. Accuracy. Nope, okay. Attack, crit damage, defense, give me speed. We always want speed. We don't get speed. We got speed there. We have speed, double accuracy, fully maxed out on my accuracy, but we're still gonna sell it just because it's just sitting there now and it doesn't have the, um, it doesn't meet the parameters that I'm looking for. Speed. Nope, everything but. 
or uh, actually, oh, okay, so yeah, never mind. We got one on speed. We don't want it though. We're not keeping that. Give me triples, triples only, except for HP. Didn't reach the uh, triple there. All right, as you can see, yeah, Savage Gear is starting to uh, pile up. So this one's gonna require a little bit more handling. We got the attack. We have double speed and accuracy, uh, but we're still gonna get rid of it. Triple accuracy. Uh, we got one on speed with accuracy, crit rate, no. No triples here. Quad attack, that's nice. Double attack, crit rate, crit damage. Really nice substats, but still, we have to start getting rid of these. It's all piling up. Triple crit damage. Get rid of it. Triple. Triple. Double. Triple. Double. And low end on speed. We got a low roll there. Roll this up here and see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Get out of here. You're not good enough. Because if it was good enough, it would have been used already. Oh, oh, crit damage. Quad crit damage. Can we get it? Oh, man. All right, we're going to sell this. Sell that. Good enough. Nope, not good enough. Not good enough. No quads. All one ones. What's wrong with you? How do these even stay here? I should just sell these as soon as I notice them. HP? Helmet? Quad? Yes, we got the triple HP. So, you know, it's pretty good. HP based nuker, eventually. Sell. Get rid of these. Get triple defense. And that's pretty bad. Not good enough for me. Uh, ba, ba, ba. Yeah, sell that. Sell it. No triple. Okay, that's a triple. Keep that. And let's see. Yeah, we're selling that. I don't see any triples here. Just start, just start ganking these because we're only looking for triples. And I need to remind myself, sometimes verbally, I have to remind myself, hey, we're, we're just looking for triples, man. Do your best to only keep triples. Crit rate. Nope. Okay. Attack. Now, this is all a bunch of ones, so we don't keep that. Resistance. But he got... <laughs> this is such a troll. Resistance on the main, but the penta potential is on the attack. Let's just roll this up to eight. And of course, okay. On the sub that I don't need. No triple there. No triples. Got a triple there. It's attack on the boot, but now everything else is kind of eh. Now these are fully ascended, so we're going to keep these anyway regardless. Defense with speed and a triple res. You know, it's, uh, it's okay. So we'll keep it. All right, we're going to reroll this, but I need a quad. Okay. I see how it is. Triple speed. Nope, no triples. Okay. Oh, got a penta roll on this destroy. That's probably what my... Oh, I remember seeing this. I think this was like my first penta roll. Speed. We got the speed. Triples. Stun set. I keep a few of. I don't really use it, but... Um, it's good enough to keep most of these, I think. Although I do have a lot of weapons, so... Let's see, triple, no triple there. We're gonna sell this. Triple, we do have a triple already. Let's see, can, can we get a quad? No quads. And this deserves being brought up already. But we're looking for things to purge. So I need to roll these up to 16 to see. And no, this does not stay. No triples there. Triple speed? No, okay. This one is accuracy. Can we get quad accuracy? Nope, okay. That one's fine. This one is gonna be a no for me just because we have flat attack on the rolls there. Triple speed here, triple accuracy, and not good enough to keep on the toxic. 
check here. We got triple res, triple. Got one on crit rate, so that's good enough for me. Provoke. And, all right, we only got a double, so we're gonna get rid of that. Ret gear. I'm not a fan of too much, but I mean, you still get some good rolls, some good off pieces, so it's, you know, decent to test out and keep to see if, you know, eventually you might find a specific champion that works well with it, well with it, or good off pieces. Triple speed's there. And we're going to sell because there's no triples there. Got one on the HP, triple, triple, triple speed. Got one on the defense there. And can we get a triple here? Oh, we got a triple crit rate, but it's on stalwart. But it's still a triple. We'll keep it. You know, maybe. Maybe one day. No, what am I saying? I'm never going to use it. <laughs> I'm never going to use this piece. This is this has got to go. Speed. Res. Speed. Please give me speed here. Triple speed. And you give me shit. I see how it is. Reflex. Uh, I'm going to sell this one. It's a flat. Give me triples. Nope. Bunch of ones. Triple crit. Triple. Oh, we got one. There, we got a one or there. A triple. Can I get... Um, what do I even want there? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. On a reflex set. Triple speed. And we got HP there. Triple attack on a curing weapon, but it's, you know, it's, it's okay. It's not something I'm going to use, but it's red, so we'll see. Accuracy. Does anybody even use curing set? I don't think so. Oh, okay. If, if I'm only going to keep curing sets, if they roll quad speeds. Nothing there. And we're definitely not going to reroll there. So just keep that one mythical curing set here. Fully ascended crit damage on cruel. Now we have a double here, so no triples there. Got one triple there. Let me see these here. Oh, we got a quad. No triples. One triple, but it's a triple on res. And accuracy for cruel? I don't know about that. It's like all the stats we don't need. All right, let me roll some of these up so we can see. Attack or speed. And no. Okay. Speed... All right, we got the low end of speed there, so we're going to sell. Give me speed. All right. I guess not. Got the crit damage, crit damage, triple crit rate, triple speed. Roll this up. Double defense, so we sell. That's a fully ascended one, so we're going to keep it. Uh, yeah, crit damage with crit damage. This one's crit damage with HP triple accuracy i don't know it does triple crit damage on a cruel set is good but i don't know we'll keep it for now keep this for now hp with triple defense potential so let's roll it up and see give me defense hey we got the triple defense take it take it take it Triple speed. Speed on speed with crit damage and attack percentage. That's good enough to keep. Triple HP. Uh, yeah, we'll keep it. It's a triple. Potential for a triple here. And no triple. Okay. Triple crit damage. Nope. Attack, give me quad speed. Give me quad speed. Oh, quad trip fucking flat defense. Attack, HP, triples. Only want triples. Let me see that accuracy. Let me see that accuracy. No accuracy. Defense, accuracy. Uh, this is a flat. We're going to sell that. HP on HP. We got the attack, but still. HP, triple deep, or triple crit, triple speed here, triple speed there, triple HP there, triple attack there, triple res there, triple speed, triple speed, triple speed. All right, perception gear we always end up getting a lot of, so I need to purge this pretty well as well. 
looking for any triples anything that's not a triple oh this one's kind of weird triple flat yeah now we're gonna sell that but hold on perceptions generally like useful all around but i'm not gonna use a chaos aura on it that's the thing i wouldn't use a chaos aura on a perception i would save it for something harder or like more valuable like a merc set so uh triple keep that get rid of this yeah just sell it get rid of it don't even look back we've got triple attack there no triples here hmm okay good enough triple speed triple speed triple crit damage fully ascended and hp nope sell it sell it sell it sell that and we got triple there flat flat hp chest how did this get by me accuracy this is almost fully ascended though so we're just going to keep that and triple speed there got one of the defense double speed good enough no triples oh my gosh we have a triple but it's triple flat get rid of that fully ascended speed accuracy defense it's low enough where i can just sell it for the ascension and triple there so we sell all that and then we're gonna rise or uh, level these up to see so if we get a triple speed here we'll keep it and we don't okay and give me triple speed here nope okay so we get rid of that triple triple now i said i was going to be holding on to my lethal gear protection gear we can let, start letting go of um as long as the reds the mythicals for the reds if it lands on a flat i'd be less than likely to keep it i might just sell it but uh, we have at least one technically on the hp so we'll keep it there give me triple accuracy all right we keep that one triple mm, res okay potential right there potential for attack we sell this because there's no triple on that one i'm really looking for for speed because protection uh it's really good for somebody like mikage or siffy so uh, i'm starting to think like for, for a protection set if it doesn't even hit or if it doesn't have speed on it i think i should just get rid of it or get rid of it speed accuracy damn okay let's see here oh uh, we got triple attack keep it uh potential there got the res there give me i'm starting to run low on silver i realized triple speed yes okay we're gonna keep that and no speed here triple though no triples yeah my my protection was starting to stock like pile up i'm glad i'm doing this sell it and keep that all right so for epics roll it up to eight if it doesn't double then i know it's not going to triple so i sell it please give me speed triple speed here nope okay and this isn't even diving into the jewelry into the accessories oh wait hold on triple crit damage even though i don't really need crit damage on protection i keep it res and crit damage on protection mm, i just don't like it sometimes you just don't like the way it looks okay keep that roll it check it no triples there triple speed there quad accuracy potential there all right so let's go over to here give me the accuracy triple nope no accuracy triple so we sell it Quad speed. Nope. Okay. Oh, well, defense. Maybe. Maybe defense. Triple defense. Take it. Take it. Take it. All right. Let's roll these up. 12. Nope. And what about here? 
Looking for triples. Oh, I'm going to drink some coffee. All right. Speed. It's kind of a low end on the low end, but if it triples, we keep it. We don't keep that. Speed. No speed there. Double. We got triple res. Keep that. All right. All right, so we have a, a string here of unrolled gear. So let's roll it up first, and then we'll sell all at once. So we're not going too far back and forth. It has one flat that I don't like. Go down the line here. All right, and... Okay, so no triples here, and it's got that. That's the one with the flat. So we sell all of this. Yeah, sell all those shields, and we're look. Oh, look at that crit damage potential for Penta attack. And see, the thing is, it's uh, I don't know. Maybe uh, keep it for now. Keep it for now. We'll re we're gonna we're gonna see. No, because on no, nah, I I wouldn't even no, because I would I would try to put yeah no, just sell it. I'm trying to convince myself here. Sell that too. Triple. Nope, no triple. Attack triple flat or yeah no, <laughs> selling this shit. All right, but if it triple, if it, you know, hits the speed, maybe we keep it? No, 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 no. It wasn't a double. Triple HP. Nope. And I don't know, maybe if it if it hits threes here. It hit the speed on flat? Dear God. Accuracy, accuracy on protection, boots, nah, I'm not feeling this one. And we're not going to reroll these, so anything that's flat, then we sell that. Okay, so check these. Attack boots, crit damage, no, yeah, no. No, just no. All right, speed boots. Ooh, give me that triple defense, though. Damn, okay. Now, I might have to make an exception for this one because I don't have, I don't really have, no, I do. What am I saying? No exceptions. When we talk, get out of here. We have a triple speed there. This is going to have to get sold, and we don't care about attack boots on this. So, yeah, definitely going down with protection. Oh, my God, my my stone skin gear, bro. This is going up and up and up. I did want to roll up some of these pinpoint pieces, but um, I think I'm done with my artifact enhancement, no? Yeah, I think I went way overboard with it.